Hello. I have finished editing my video. It is currently here. Oh, this is actually a completely unrelated footage. Uh, but I mean, there was not a lot of editing. I'm just waiting for it to export. You can hear my computer. Wine. It's not doing too hot. We're gonna do the smart thing and just leave it here and we have to start packing. It is currently just past one o'clock, the day before my flight. Yeah, I gotta start uh, putting this stuff away. It's currently uploading. My back is still sitting there. This is never gonna get done. Dog, backpack. We got three bags I'm gonna be planning to bring. Big boy, small boy, back boy. We're gonna be going through each one of them, and, uh, well, I mean, you don't need to see all my underwear, but I'll show you what I'm bringing. Extra phone stand, lubes, cable, all my cubs. That's it. Almost forgot about this. Screwdriver, adjuster, extra parts. Can't leave home without this. Okay. After, oh shoot, I almost forgot something else. Ha ha! Bonk. Okay. I am in my kitchen with like my groceries and stuff. But I think I've gotten everything that I need for the backpack. Including a backpack. What I'm going to be doing is taking this backpack and putting in that backpack. Uh, but let me go through some of the other stuff. This is research. These are books. I'm almost done with this one. And so, in case I finish this, I will start with the Rosie Project on the flight. This one's apparently set in Melbourne and was suggested to me by a friend. Pencil case, research notebooks, and the company that I used to work at. This is a wristband for Dennis. He left it at my house uh, about a month ago, and I'm going to bring it back to him. And this has a million, bajillion, I have no idea. Where do I find exactly how big it is? I don't know. It's big enough. I've had this for the last couple of championships, and now it has a fancy schmancy little charger on it for Australia, and it's fully charged. Headphones, noise cancelling, these are new, never had these on a flight before, really excited. Laptop, speaker, uh, USB-C to A, USB-C to C, f uh, smartwatch charger, and then computer charger. And of course, the, lap the, the backpack exception, didn't forget these. This is not working as well as I had hoped. There's too much stuff. I gotta redo this. Uh, 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 there's too much stuff. So I decided to change stuff up, up a bit. I took my lubes out of that bag and I put them in here. Now I have lubes in my bag. I also put that bag over there with like most of my cubes, but I still have my two main three by threes for the flight. I'm gonna try and read these books. I'm gonna try and do this research read these papers uh, so I don't plan on cubing that much on the flight it's usually disruptive anyway uh, and I yeah moved a bunch of stuff over and uh, hopefully this works please work oh wee wee what do we have here all right I'm about to get decked out for worlds hi I'm back. What do I do? I hold stuff. Nom 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 nom. Ooh, one more thing. Melatonin. Gotta use this to sleep on the flight. Otherwise I can't sleep on planes. I have the small boy. Toiletries. One day of clothes. Jackets. Both of them. Pajamas for the plane. Call me crazy but I love it. And cubes under here. And slippers. This is my survival kit. This is day one. If I lose my big bag I at least will have a day's worth of clothes. I can sleep. I like slippers. And I can brush my teeth. I'm gonna see if it fits. Okay. This is like one of those clamp things. I'm just gonna. Now it's time for our wrap up. Let's give it everything we got. Ready? B -b begin. Just kidding. It's the big boy. I gotta fill the big boy up with big boy stuff. Okay, honestly, the last one is the easiest because I've just been throwing 
shoes and stuff in here. Shoes, clothes, so this is like miscellaneous stuff, vest, denim shirt, these are all shirts and undergarments. This is Maryland flag on top of socks. This is a pair of pajamas on top of pants and more, well, one cubicle shirt and more, more pants down here. And uh, that's a giant pile of shirts. That's it. I'm packed. So I feel like it's typical when packing to have like 99, like 95% of the stuff really fast. And then you need to spend so long thinking about the last couple of things. I need a power strip. I don't have one that isn't small or already being used. Uh, this one's too small. I need something that has more than four ports. Mm, I could get away with just four ports. I don't want to. So we're still looking. I don't know about you, YouTube. This right here, this power strip is just so beautiful. Look at it. So many ports. A plug. That's all I need. Oh, shoot. I almost forgot. I almost forgot these. Very important. These is passport. The ability for me to leave this country. Oh man, I'm so smiley in that one. This is money. Money in the bank. Pimpin' ain't easy. Money. Bank. Pimpin' ain't easy. I gotta clean this up now. Good morning. It is the start of day zero. Day zero is travel day. Well, I guess, technically, if we get there day one, then today's day minus one. Because it is Tuesday, July 2nd. We will arrive July 4th. Oh, there's so much travel. Anyway, I'm kind of gross looking because I just finished eight miles. Sort of morning exercise before sitting all day and then maybe all day tomorrow as well. God. So, I uh, thought I'd get some running in. Anyway, I'll see you guys when I'm a little cleaner. So it's the morning of my flight to Australia. Uh, it leaves in the afternoon and I'll be going to San Francisco first and then to Sydney. Loki started packing very late last night, so I'm not done yet. Last minute packing updates. Frisbee. Power strip. I remembered my toothbrush. We're ready. I've got two suitcases for the trip, mostly mostly full of clothes. And then the bag I'll be bringing um, around is going to be the new Gan one. And I like that it has spots for water bottles and umbrellas on the sides. And then I've got, of course, ooh, my cubes. And then I'm going to put some chargers and... Uh, a bunch of accessories there, and then I have some space on the top for headphones and other things like that. So yeah, super excited! Our flight isn't for uh, seven hours, so we got a little time to kill. It doesn't open until 1.30. So I'm just kind of chilling on a Starbucks. Hooray. Blah. I met up with Dennis. It's 1.28. We're almost ready to get into our Alaska line. How you doing, Dennis? I'm Snapchatting. It's yeah? It's three, you know what I mean? I feel ya. How's, uh, how's Dana doing, do you know? So my flight got canceled and rescheduled to three hours earlier, so I've been running around like crazy getting my stuff done. This is what I get for packing late. But uh, now I'm gonna start leaving. Or, yeah, I'm gonna leave soon and hopefully get to the airport on time. She's dying, man. Oh God, She's what happened What happened to her? Flight got delayed, so she had to pack her stuff. No, it got canceled. It canceled, that's what it was. And she had to get her stuff ready in three hours. Yeah, and because none of it's ready. her flight was originally at like 3 p.m. going out to the West Coast, but it changed to 1 p.m. and she had to stop in Dallas. So she now is a layover, which gets her there at the same time, but like, the flight was a couple hours earlier. Like, Dane is going to vlog this as well, maybe, and, and <laughs> she'll complain about this. Like, oh, yeah. No, I feel so bad. That'll be a fun vlog. I feel so bad for Dana. That'll be a good vlog. Fortunately for us, we've had no problems. Except, yep. last goes over to 1.30. Whatever. Doesn't matter. See you guys on the other side. Fitting out now. Got all my stuff packed. Bye. I just got stopped at security because of my cubes, but we're through now and hopefully I'll still make my flight even though it got moved three hours earlier.
think it's gotten flag Dennis and just lots of waiting we're getting lunch Dennis is fancy and he films and he's filming on his phone mm. oh my our GoPro yeah. phone. that's gross dude I guess I'm gonna do the same thing though yeah. <laughs> so I'm no better than Dennis or we had a uh, very high player. service thanks wisely big boy Women's World Cup. No goal by England. Very exciting. Large enough crowds. <laughs> Go USA! Running into Tanzer at the airport. What flight are you on? Mine? No, I'm on, I'm on a different one, but they're 20 minutes apart going to the exact same place. And same for Sydney? Yeah. Yeah. Well, makes no sense. well, we tried, but Orbitz did weird stuff and hey, Tanzer, well, you know is, Tanzer is just like, all right, I'm going to go on. Oh, We're getting there in book. one piece, at least. Yeah, seemingly. that's the hope, but... We've got only, oh shoot, less than an hour until departure. I've been here for six hours. Tans has been here for 20 minutes, so he may have made the smarter decision. They just called the last group. I'm lazy, and so I don't ever want to go on a plane. We've got Dennis. We're about to leave. Goodbye, DCA. Hello, SFO. When was the last time you were on a plane, Dennis? Five, six years ago. Oh no. Last time for me was Boston for the Red Bull event. Okay, so here's an update on the situation. We are currently still 9.20 p.m., still three hours left. It's nine o'clock right now, but it's really six o'clock, so you got a little while. I moved seats to say hi to Dennis. Better than Tanzer. Poor Tanzer, what we've learned, do? is... Uh, he's, this flight never left. Yeah, so, so he's still stuck in DCA right now. So he's still here. I'm curious if he'll make more of Sydney or not now. I think he'll arrive Friday morning at the worst. I think, yeah. One day is okay. Better he'll not. be he'll be tired, he'll but be very tired. But one day's okay. See, Wisely's like, oh, I'm not worried, and then he says stuff like that. Boing, boing, boing. Touchdown. We have less than one hour to switch terminals and get to Dana. Fingers crossed, we do it. So, Dennis, we just landed in SFO, beautiful airport. We're not gonna look at any of it. Oh, they have a few. We are beelining towards the international terminal. Because currently, it is, I don't know what time is it, it is 9.34, 9.35, we have 50 minutes to get there. Wisely says, it's fine, we'll have no problems. I might be freaking out a little bit more, but I'm, I'm feeling okay. We won't, have, we won't have time to sit and lounge, we won't have time to go shopping. You know, at this point, you get used to disappointment, so <laughs> Well, I mean, Haven't I'm glad I just my WCA. I'm just it's always downhill. What's that 598 you got like four weeks or three weeks ago? Oh, Shut up, buddy. Dennis. You did fine. Um, the only nerve wracking thing is just how close it is. But at least we're here. Yeah, Poor Tanzer is stuck in DCA right now. Or no, he's no, flying over here for the night. He's, he's, he's gonna be staying in San Francisco for the night. Thank God. Well, at least we're flying to Sydney. We'll get there Thursday morning. So. No missed connections, and uh, we'll update you when we get there. Dennis has just realized that we have to go through security. I'm sorry, Dennis. Uh, I don't want to hear that wisely. I'm so excited, though. I've, I've amassed almost 20,000 steps on Tuesday, and so Wednesday I will have exactly zero steps. You know, it will start raining. In Sydney, it's supposed to be raining for, like, the entire time that we're there, which sucks. That's the thing. Oh, Bart! Oh, God. Dennis, I don't want to vlog anymore about this, but we're currently in our terminal, and that red line, which is supposed to take us over to the international terminal, it's down, and the blue, like, just left. Oh, wait, no, there's another blue. Okay, we'll be okay, we'll be okay. All right, made it through. Uh, well, we made it onto the train and off the train. We are now on our way 
to gates A1 to 12. Okay, we're in priority line, I'm waiting for security. Skip all this, still a line. Down. Shut up, Dennis. They had to swap my bag because I've got a tons of cubes in it. We're going to A6, just around the corner. Do we see Dana? No, no Dana yet. I told you we would get stopped. Get Dude, I, it's never happened to me before, and the one time is when we don't have time. But we have time. Hundreds of magnets. What time is it, dude? All right, yeah, we got time. Plenty of time. Yeah, I'm no longer worried. I'm not worried. Shut up, so wisely. Worried. Stop. This is bullying. It's bullying, and it's freaking. It's like one in the morning right now. No, I'm Keaton. Dude, if my step count hits twenty thousand, does that mean I don't have to walk tomorrow? I'm gonna miss all of tomorrow. Yeah. I can. I'm losing to Dennis. Ah! Where's Dana? Where's Dana? Dana yeet. Where's Dana? Dana yeet. Dana, 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 Dana. Dana. That's not Dana. That's not Dana. On a short girl. I don't. I, I don't see Dana. Where's elevator to A6? Is it downstairs? Boarding is down the escalator. I want to see that face and know that I'm safe. A8, A6, 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 where's Dana? Dana Yee! Oh my god, yes! Oh! What's up? <laughs> You're so in my I'm, uh, Thank you. Let's go. We made it. We essentially are the last people on the flight, Wisely. Shut up, Dan. Shut up, Wisely. I'm glad we made it. Dana. Yeah. There's a point where we, like, we were kind of worried that we weren't going to make it. Yeah. And we were going to be like, well, I have the keys to the Airbnb. Also, and I like, want service out of this country. You yeah. This way, right? Well, just follow, follow the people. Follow the sound of the airplane. <laughs> yeah. So like, we were gonna be like, okay, well, Dana can find a place to crash, and we'll just tell the guy, hey, we're coming at, you know, after 2 p.m. Yeah. Just the next day. But we made it. We'll get there on time. Except Hanzi. So you can't bring food on a plane. So what did we do? We bring on food. On <laughs> Okay, Dennis. So, <laughs> What's your revelation? What did you find on the flight? Wait, wait, wait. Well, Dana found it. I found it, but... Ethernet port and my Ethernet cable. I, I'm going to... They're like, you, you, need to, you need to pay for this Wi-Fi. Mm -mm. Dennis is going to hook up his computer via Ethernet. The year is 2019. I've never Dennis, played Dota. how many hardcore games do you expect to play on this? 2048. All right. You never know, man. And CubeSim. Also, I'm eating, I'm eating salad. Oh, where'd my dongle go? Here it is. This is so dumb. <laughs> so dumb. It's Wait, dude, what the heck happened to your armchair? Oh, uh, it's, it's a bit boneless. What's wrong with it? It's, there's nothing wrong. <laughs> I don't know about you. It's a bit boneless. It's a bit boneless. It is boneless, dude. Wait, Dennis, you cannot just wait like two minutes. Put this down, dude. Eat yeah, your salad. Did Didn't your mom ever tell you not to play at the dinner table? No. Look at this dinner table. It is the <clears> size <throat> of your computer. It is your computer. Bone apple teeth. Okay, I'll judge Dennis for that one. I don't think Clash of Clans deserves to be on anyone's phone. Excuse me. Um, I'm pretty good at it. My, 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 my base is, let me tell you, it's strong. Okay, compare your Clash of Clans ability to your cubing ability. Oh, cubing is way better. Are you sure? <laughs> oh, yes. Are you kidding me? I don't spend money in Clash of Clans. So Dana, do you have any vices? Uh, no, probably, no? but I don't play Clash of Clans. But you play Sim. But you don't learn anything. Yeah. Every time I do, I, I, I do sing all the That's time. a vice, Dana, for sure. No, that's a vice. Well, you, no, no, you can't even say it with a straight <laughs> yeah. face. You can't even go through the whole statement. Anyway, we're yeah, waiting. Is that a valid excuse? <laughs> I start in class and I start doing it. I don't even I, My professors know I don't listen to them. And, they know I don't care. Yeah. See, don't I, really care. I haven't played Sims since sophomore year, so I guess... I just learned it. So. And That's those okay. those can still tippity-tap faster than mine. Almost up 10. Into this later, like, in a couple of days when you actually edit this footage, don't put the audio in. Just have a, a clip of me talking with Dennis, like, meeting back and forth, mm -hmm. and then some view on the outside. Oh. Gee, we shall hold it.
Dang, I almost forgot. This plane takes forever to speed up. Oh my god. <laughs> so soon. <laughs> okay, so, hi Dennis. Hi Dana. Hello. It is uh, currently back in Maryland, 2.45 in the morning. I woke up at 5.30. Whenever I lean back in my seat, whenever I lean back in my seat, and if I close my eyes, I can feel my body relaxing, just being like, go to sleep, Keaton. So there's that. I'm so tired. I need to be awake for the next like four hours. Got it. So this is the meal that Qantas gives you. One of those. One this? of three. That. Bing, bang, bop. Waiting for mine and Dana's. You didn't order yet, so you'll be last. Sucks. Sorry, Dana. Well, we all just ate. Oh, I can see myself in the mirror. I mean, I see myself, so it must be fabulous. Ooh, get wrecked. <laughs> Wait, who's getting wrecked there, Dennis? Because you're seeing yourself. That's already a good view. Dana is a beautiful young woman. <laughs> Des deserving of any... What do you mean? I don't know. Like 12, look at her height. Young woman. Were you not called young man when you were like 10? Usually, at that point... I was like, growing like... No, no, on I on it peach fuzz when I was like 12, all right? Like, Honestly, though, when I was 10, young man was usually followed by, go to your room. <laughs> That's a good one. Yeah. Okay, bone apple teeth, dude. Okay, and what did you get? I got boof. Boof? Boof. Okay. With veg and the, uh, the dinner roll. I and can smell your cucumber. It smells so good. The dinner roll and the, <laughs> the bar. Oh, it's very hot, actually. You yeah. right. Ooh. Ooh. Actually, it's really good. Boof, potato, and a couple of veggies. Okay, so real, like other airlines need to learn about this. This is beef and mashed potato and delicious gravy sauce with some veggies. I've had so many flight meals. Like, Dane and we've had some, and they're just the worst kind of things. I just shiver thinking about the stuff that we ate on the way to Euros. I feel like international airlines do better than American. I'd rather just have American Airlines just give me, like, McDonald's. Yeah. Alright, I got macaroni and other stuff. We have cleaned uh, two out of the three trays Ross, to yeah, make trying. room for laptops. So we're, we're trying to stay awake to get on that time zone, but it, it, doesn't, it doesn't seem to be happening over here. I'm just so tired. It is... 3.45 a.m. on the East Coast, it is 12.45 a.m. on the West Coast, it is 5.45 p.m. in Sydney. We're like two hours away from having an almost normal sleep schedule, like geriatric, fine. Going to bed at 7.45 p.m., fine. Uh, no. Look how close we are. So no. In another attempt to stay awake, we are on... Uh, I'm getting 11s because I know how to do O L L. Okay. I don't know. What, I don't know what to do. <laughs> That's so exciting. Like seven yes, we can see a continent. <laughs> We've been over water for so long. Oh. Yeah. And we crossed the international date line, so you sort of lost the day. When we arrived in about two hours time, we're looking at touchdown at about six o'clock. So uh, it'll be the fourth of July, yeah, Australian time, anyway. Landed in Sydney. Happy 4th of July, guys. Happy 4th. Happy Independence Day. Finally on the ground. We made it. We did it. <laughs> ground. This we is made amazing. It. Yay. McDonald's. <laughs> We're Relax. about to see chiropractor Shinner Keaton here. Relax. <laughs> so we are, where are we? We are here. And we're going to take this line up Central. there and take this line up here somewhere. Our Airbnb is. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying. Keaton, where are we going? That's a good question. Good point. But look at this. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's like Grand Central Station from like 1900. <laughs> Except there's no people in it, but it still smells bad. <laughs> like gasoline, but not the yeah. That's the difference. All right. Sorry, Nathan. I'll, I'll go to a giant back. shopping mall. You guys want to just go chill in a giant shopping mall. But where do I put our suitcases? <laughs> Darling Drive. Drive. And these people are on the right side of the car. Right. Yeah. Right. And we're going to try and chill in a... What is it, a shopping center? We're 
are in a shopping center. Dude Sweets. Did you say, what did you call? Oh. Dude Sweets, yeah. Wait, ready? Keaton, look up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, what if you're a kid? People look like they're frowning. Yeah, they look like sad American outfits. <laughs> oh god, you're such a tourist. Do is my hand. All right, so we That's came all the way to Australia to the, get to get. Hold up. Well, no, the bigger thing is Big this is the first meal. Burger. This okay, is the first meal. This is my first Australian meal. Not this only, was Dennis's idea. Not only did we come all the way to Australia to get. I'm gonna or, let you do this. To yeah. get McDonald's, we got a what is it? A Big, Big Brecky, Brecky burger. burger. This is not a U.S. thing. I, I've never seen it in any good. McDonald's. I would believe. You're gonna split it. That's so gross. It's bun and then burger and then egg and then cheese and then bacon and barbecue it's, sauce and a hash brown. It smells like bacon. I guess they upgraded that in the U.S. All right, I want to bite. That was pretty good, actually. Big bite. That's pretty good. That surprisingly works. Chilling in a mall. We're waiting for our Airbnb, so we're gonna. <laughs> so now we're just cubing. See that? See this? Dana copied me. I did not copy you. Dana copied me. I got it first. I'm all waiting to our Airbnb. You guys I ate some burgers and we found Jeff Franco. Say hi. Where? Where is he? Oh, one key. Ah, me. Yeah. It's <laughs> point two, point one. Oh man. Alright. Three, two. Oh, sorry. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. Can I slow on this? So this is, this is 3 by 3 versus 3 by 3 blind corners and execution yeah. members yeah. and execution reporters. That's nuts! Right? Set, go. Mm. Okay. I got one. <laughs> I, was, I was getting scared. Okay, ready? Yeah. Set, go. I heard that. <laughs> did you do? Sorry, I just saw that, it, it, like, I it was that what? Hi. Don't be weird. You brought your flag. I brought the flag. I, I wonder. I wonder what state he's from. <laughs> Maryland, we're all Virginia. You. Raise high the black and gold. Yeah, this is our. Nothing half so okay. glorious as to see our team victorious. We got the team boys, we got the steam boys. So keep on fighting, don't give in. There's more. M A R Y L A N D Maryland will win. No, you guys have to see. Go Maryland. No, it's the U and D song. All right, I'm here. With the same people that I'm always with, we uh, we got to our Airbnb. So look, no backpacks, no luggage. Yay! The guy was nice enough to let us in early, so we dropped our stuff off. And while they're cleaning, we're gonna go grab some dim sum, some dim sum, dim sum, some dim dum. Let's get some. Some dim sum. <laughs> okay, bye. 